On the night of March 18, Sacramento police officers fired 20 shots at Stephon Clark, an unarmed black man. Eight shots hit Clark and killed him. Show me your hands! Gun! 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 The police officers believed Clark was pointing a gun at them, but it turned out to be only a cell phone. Under current federal court rulings, police officers may be prosecuted for the use of deadly force only if it was not objectively reasonable. However, states can pass their own laws defining what constitutes an impermissible use of force. Sacramento Assemblymember Kevin McCarty and other legislators have introduced legislation that would limit the use of force by police to situations where it is necessary to prevent a person from harming themselves or others. Supporters say it will reduce police shootings and note that four states which require law enforcement to exhaust all reasonable means before using deadly force have a 17% lower rate of police killings. Opponents say the change will lead to police getting killed themselves or an increase in criminal activity. What do you think? Should California change the standard for prosecuting law enforcement officers involved in shootings from an objectively reasonable standard to one authorizing force only when necessary, given the totality of the circumstances?